gonna start it again. So does gunk motor flush really work? That's what we're going to be trying today on this 1965 Impala SS with a 327. That's pretty neglected. So this motor flush you're supposed to add directly to the oil and then bring your engine up to operating temperature for about 5 minutes. And then drain the oil and change it, supposedly removing any gunk inside the engine. Keep in mind this was a seized engine when we got it and we attributed it to not much more than a boat anchor at the time. We have been paying particularly close attention to the lifters actually pumping up and pumping oil to the valves. Without that proper lubrication is not achieved and it can cause engine failure. <laughs> Bigger. Well, I got the bigger one. Seven, eight. <laughs> <laughs> Missed by quite a bit. <laughs> wow, that was a big one. Yeah. Sure smells. Is it? Yeah, like gas or something. Oh, then the carb's pushing a lot of gas down. Yeah. really watery well, that's yeah that's what it's meant to do right can't be too bad try not to get this oil absolutely everywhere <laughs> Well, it looks more like oil than the last time, this cartridge <laughs> filter. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> that got me right in the eye. <laughs> Oops. Got that all over your pyramid. <laughs> I think I got more over my face. <laughs> yeah, I could, yeah, use a rag. <laughs> Looks better than the first one. It was full of sludge. So the inside of pretty big filter. I don't know if we're going to find out anymore. It's obvious that it did something. Yeah. Didn't plug it, but... Yeah, it's not a huge amount. Nothing to worry about anyway. Still good. Always make sure to put your high zinc oil in these old classic cars, flat tabbit cams.
can I do it? No funnel? 